Choose the problems you want to have. Losing weight, gaining muscle, starting a business, deciding to follow a new career path, writing a book. Each one of these choices takes time, energy, focus, and consistent action. Each one of these choices requires a series of habits, behaviors, and routines that will support you in being able to reach that goal. In every one of these choices, there is an aspect of self-acceptance. This is the slow and very unsexy approach to personal growth, transformation, losing weight, gaining muscle, or achieving your goals. It's not sexy because it's not something you can find on the internet for three easy payments of $19.95. And if you order now, I'm gonna send you these special offers worth over $2,000 in extra bonuses. When you make a choice, a choice that serves you, a choice that helps you move closer towards your goals, you accept both the good and the bad that comes with that choice. You accept the problems that come with that choice. To really, truly excel in life and to achieve your goals, you need to fully accept your problems. Recognize that you made these choices and with these choices come problems and to make do with them. Some people will say, well, the grass is greener on the other side. What they fail to tell you about that cliche is that there's a second part of it and it goes something like this. The grass on the other side is covered in dog shit and you're the one who has to clean it up. The next time that you're complaining that you can't lose weight, the next time that you're complaining about your boss and your job, the next time you're complaining about that unfinished novel that you're still working on, the next time you're complaining about the problems in your relationship with your partner, your spouse, or your children, ask yourself this question. Are these problems that I want to have in my life? And maybe you want to get some help from other people to get there in order to transform your life for the better. Am I willing to stop complaining and take action on solving my problems? So is this a tough love video? Absolutely. If you've been dragging your heels and complaining all the time every single step along the way, either shit or get off the pot. And I know this question is kind of a perverse ass backwards approach to goal setting and self-acceptance. Take a moment and ask yourself, what are the problems I really want to have in my life?